Hello Drive Radio fans, Richard Rush here today with Walt McLean behind the camera. Today we're going to take a look at the 2019 Toyota Sienna. Uh, and this is going to be look a little bit different, mainly from there's a little badge on that side which says all-wheel drive and there's now all-wheel drive optional for the SE trim level which is what this model is of course. Um, and outside of that there's not a whole lot of changes cosmetically and, and exterior wise it's pretty much the same. So with that being said Walt, let's just jump right in, kind of give everyone a walk around again. This is re was introduced back in 2011, this current model. Other manufacturers have come out with their own iterations of the, uh, of, or newer minivans I should say, and, and I'll be honest, I, I, I've got to believe that a Sienna refresh is on its way sooner rather than later. So I mentioned the all-wheel drive is optional on this SE trim, which is great for, for climates like ours here in Colorado, where you do get that snow from time to time. I really, really like that feature and that aspect of it. So I'm going to open the front door here for you, Walt, so you can show everyone what that looks like. You've got heated front seats here, dual climate control for the front seats, and obviously, obviously you got your climate control for the rear as well. It's got an updated infotainment system, um, new for 2019, as well as the Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, which again, Toyota actually, I believe, just announced at the beginning of this year, and is a really, really great feature um, that I'm a fan of personally, and, and it works really, really well, so I'm glad Toyota's kind of jumped on that bandwagon. Uh, it makes, there's a lot less hassle that way. So while it's kind of showing you the rest of the interior, it's very e easy, very usable space. You do have a sunroof in there, very front of this, which is a nice feature there. Um, and I like that aspect of it. You've got all your safety features that you're wanting. That, that's again becoming more and more standard, and especially on Toyota. You've got your lane departure assist, your photo collision warning, that sort of thing. Here's obviously the minivan. Everyone knows you know the sliding rear doors, which is great. You've got your captain's chair here in the middle, which is really, really nice. Armrest on both. You can maneuver, maneuver the seat forward all the way. You can actually recline these second row seats, which is really, really nice feature. You've got power ports in the middle, which are great. Your vents as well. And then you do have one will show you the entertainment system up above there. It's actually kind of a dual screen system. It's really wide um, that way, which is a nice feature. You've got wireless headsets, which is great as well. These back windows do come down about three quarters of the way, and it does have a rear sunshade, which is really, really nice. I'm going to open up the trunk here for you and show you this. Um, one thing to note with those captain's chairs, and some other manufacturers have the capability to actually stow those seats in the floorboards. You can remove those seats, although they are going to be maybe a little bit heavier than some of, some of its rivals. So Walt, as we come to the back here, this third row is a 60-40 row right here. Um, you can see one of the rows, or I guess one of the seats is already up. We were in there this week. I'm going to show you how easy it is to put this down with one hand. Really, really a great feature there. I love that. There's 12 cup holders total throughout the entire cabin of this. You do have some sunshades back here if you're going to use this back area um, quite a bit, which is really, really nice. And again, this back area, is, it kind of dips down, which is a great feature there. So what else? Well, there's really not a whole lot on this vehicle. Again, this is the SE trim level. This is base price of $44,000. 865 as it sits right here 45,910 a lot of features again safety features the rear entertainment system the heated seats which is great um, you've got the the all-wheel drive aspect which is a great feature as well you've got your cargo system up top I love that fuel economy 18 and 24 for an average of 20 we've actually been able to average right around 21 uh, and really I guess uh, what is our opinion of this vehicle well honestly we love this. L love the minivan. Uh, some people are gonna gonna say they hate it. Some people aren't gonna love it at all. Whatever it might be, all I would say is this: is it is a fantastic car to drive. Uh, minivans are really functional. Some people may not like the looks of them, but you can't beat the utility and the use of the minivan as a whole. And, and if you're in the market for it, the Sienna is going to be a very uh, competitive vehicle in this segment. And it may not have everything you want, but it may have everything you, you need and even more. So with that being said, has your local Toyota dealer test drive this vehicle. Get out in it. Get yourself in it. Get your family in it, of course. And when you do that, let them know that John and Richard Rush from Drive Radio sent you.